Oh, this baby and child are lying motionless. Let me check if they are conscious or not. Tap on the shoulder for the child and tap on the soul for the infant and call the name loud and clear. They will move or talk or cry or open their eyes if conscious. If they are unconscious, remove what is there inside the mouth that is visible but do not pop blindly. Check for the breathing by look, listen and feel. Look for the chest rise, listen to the breath and feel the breath. If they are breathing, put them in the recovery position as shown. If they are not breathing or if they are gasping, start CPR. Make sure you call 108. If you are a lone rescuer, give 5 cycles of CPR before calling for help. CPR has two components. One is chest compression and the second is giving breaths. Chest compressions are given just above the tip of the breastbone for children and just below the nipple line for infants. The rate is 100 to 120 per minute and the depth has to be such that one third to maximum of half of the chest goes in. For children use one hand and for infants use two fingers. For breaths, tilt the head, lift the chin, pinch the nose, take a deep breath and blow into the child's mouth for one second. Now remember, if it's an infant, do not pinch the nose and blow into the child's nose and mouth together as shown. Continue the cycle of 30 chest compressions and 2 breaths till help arrives or the person starts breathing or if you are tired. If you are tired, hand over CPR to someone else. Do not tilt the forehead, lift the chin or turn the baby or the child. If there is a potential risk for spinal injury as in the case of accident or fall from height. Ensure the scene is safe. If there is a fire accident, move the person away from that area. If it's on the road, please stop the traffic. And your safety first. So if it's a complete stranger, do only chest compressions. Do not give breaths. And if you have any cuts on your hands, make sure they don't come in contact with the stranger's blood. Learn CPR. Learn first aid for choking and seizures. Keep your loved ones safe.